If you take someone with very good gymnastic skills, um, with power and explosion, with the brains of a chess grandmaster and the endurance of a 5,000 metre runner and you mix them all together, then you've probably got a, a pretty decent badminton player there. Yuran's a fast, explosive player, likes to play in a typical Indonesian style, um, which is to, to change pace very suddenly. He's really aggressive from the back of the court, sometimes a little bit too aggressive, and that's something we've been trying to, to change within his game to give him a bit more patience in building up rallies, especially at important points at crucial times of the game. I'd like him to be able to play a few more what we call nothing shots where you're not seeking to gain a lot of advantage, you're just not giving the advantage away to your opponent and that's something he needs to learn as part of his build up. But he's extremely powerful, has a lot of variation from the back of the court. At the front of the court I think his net play could improve a bit more that could actually take him to another level. At the moment, he's ranked world number 51. He's had a high this year moving into the Olympics of 46 in the world. Personally, I believe he, he's a top 30 player. Um, when he gets to his peak, he, he'll be even better than that. Um, at 25, he's probably about three years away from his peak, three to four years away for a European player. We've had one piece of uh, success before with Wouter Class and uh, Natalie de Camp uh, winning the first ever uh, European medal for Belgium and uh, won a bronze medal in mix. But we've also now started to win some uh, junior European medals. Leanne was the first winning European bronze and ladies singles at under 19 and um, Flora van der Hoek has uh, won with you know, in Crete, um, they won a, a bronze medal in ladies' doubles in the European under-17s. I'm sure every, every player that's going is desperate to represent their country in the best manner they possibly can. But for badminton, the Olympics is the outstanding pinnacle of achievement. So for us to have two players going, a brother and sister, for me it's a remarkable uh, story. Leanne will be the first woman uh, from Belgium to go in the badminton competition and Johan is only the third uh, male to go and in fact I don't think we've had anybody going since 2000 I think was the last one so 12 years without representation so for me it's it's a huge story it's a huge chance for all the badminton supporters to get out there and publicise that we've got these two players going and to make everybody watch for them on television. We don't get that much television coverage. I'm sure we will at the Olympics.